but there was a small group of very wealthy men who actually made the decisions for the country. And then these two guys who commanded the army. Okay? Athenians, did you catch that? Very different, isn't it? All right? Do the people in, in Sparta, do the people in general have any say in their government? No, only this small, elite little group, all right, is running the country. I have a, a favorite um, saying that if you don't know history, you don't know anything. You're a leaf that doesn't know it's part of a tree. And I want the kids to know that they are part of this tree. I want to fill out the tree for them, that awareness of where, where they come from, what they're, what they're a part of. We need to look at the history of everybody. It's a more chronological and global approach from the beginning. It's not just global now. Just because we're in the modern age, uh, you know, there is reason to look at the, the whole world uh, from the beginning. We tend to think of this being the end of something, you know, that we are at the end of this long period of history. I try to get them to see that we're, we're at the beginning of things in many ways.